Space. The final frontier. These are the voyages of a new Trekkie. My five year mission to search out Star Trek media, to seek out our fans and merchandise, to boldly go where no fan has gone before. Greetings and salutations. Today, looking at the truly heartbreaking, sad story, the truly sad story of the time when George Decay and his family were sent to an American internment camps. Internment camp. So this story is a little bit too much for you, I would not blame you. Um, we have other videos that can you could check out as well. Without further ado, let's get talking about today's topic. In 1942, following the signing of Executive Order 1906, the Takei family was forced to live in the converted horse stables of Santa. Sent to the park before being sent to River War Reloc Relocation Center for internment in Rohar, Arkansas. Heard it over uh, with other Japanese American families to the stable area and assigned a horse stall for us to sleep in. From a two bedroom home, front yard, backyard, on Garnet Street in LA to a horse stall. For my parents, it was a degrading, humiliating, painful experience to take their three children into that smelly horse stall. Okay, it said, I was, five year, I was five years old, but I will never be able to forget that morning when my father came into the bedroom that I shared with my brother and told us to wait in the living room while my parents did some last minute packing. Henry and I were at the front window just gazing out. And suddenly we saw two soldiers marching up our driveway, carrying rifles with shiny bayonets on them. They stomped up the front porch and started banging on the door. Henry and, I, Henry and I were petrified. My father came out and answered the door. And they pointed the bayonet at him and said, Get your family at this house. Our home. I will never be able to forget that horrifying, terrifying morning. At the end of World War II, after leaving Tull internment camp, Takei's family were left without any bank accounts, home, or family business. This left them limb, this left them unable to hold any housing, so they lived so they sadly lived on Skid Row, Los Angeles for five years. Takei has had said that the Attorney General of California at the time, Earl Warren, claimed that the Japanese were inscrutable and advised they'd be locked away, despite a lack of reports of spying or sabotage. Takei has said of his experiments he began to question. Takei recently spoke to Metro about his experience, describing his curiosity about, about his experience. He began to question, how could the government that's supposed to be a democracy treat innocent people that way? George Takei has a new musical, Leaders. It tells the story of the Kimura family and their struggles after the Pearl Harbor attack. December 7th, 1941. The groundbreaking musical. Freeze it. Let's face the fire. Inspired by George Takei's true life experience. Allegiance. Starring Tony Award winner Leia Salonga and George Takei. He explained the story's medium fit, fits the subject matter as many people in the community camps found joy for your music during their suffering. Allegiance held its world premiere in 2012 at San Diego's Old Globe Theatre. After setting box office records, the musical will travel to London for its European premiere at Sharon Cross Theatre, where it will be playing until April Dave. Thank you for watching today's video. I shall most definitely see you next time.